Ultra points with that, so it's gonna be and what we got twenty nodes total. Doesn't tell me anything about the connections though. Well, we'll get that started eventually. How much do we have belts? I wonder. Decent chunk. We get another stack of. Oh no 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 no! I didn't mean to take that many. That should be fine. Bit of those. Those iron, we're still doing all right. Coal seems to be doing all right here. How much have we got on the uh, filters? I've got over 400. Plastics, we are still plenty. Crystals, we have a decent chunk. At least one of them is not working full speed. It helps a little bit. And oh, we're actually gathering a tiny stockpile of. Uh, Refined oil here. Much mind you. It might actually be just emptying right now, for all we know. There, there's plenty of diamonds at least. That's good. That's still almost full. That. I'm not entirely sure if these have uh, lost a lot of storage between all during this research or not. Not significant amounts at least. Maybe a tiny bit. Over here we are still having a problem with these productions. I do wonder... What do we need for the... Quantum printing, so this would be the fastest... Oh right, yeah, we need the... Quantum chips. We've started, but we have not completed yet. Also, what do we need for this one? Use a collected resource of gas giant, it needs to consume the collected fuel materials to maintain the energy required to work orbit. That seems like it's very expensive. That would allow us to gather up some resources from our parent over here. Uh, so how much can we get from this? Collectible hydrogen. Uh, about 0.9 per second and deuterium 0.03, so not a lot. Right then, that might be a problem. I do like the visual effect of the um, solar cells being shot in there. Although I do realize that it's not necessarily the most effective way of getting energy. Oh, we got 130 capacity now. Okay, that's not too bad. Actually, quite an improvement. At least for the time being. I suppose I could take some solar panels once again. Wonder, uh, do we have we've got plenty of stuff in our huge? I get another full set of uh, solar panels. Now I'm going to go visit the other planet real quick. Look how's the situation there? Because the researchers are going to take a long while. Not too much that I can do about it. I mean, technically, like. There are a few things that I could do to speed things up. Frankly, I'm just kind of dreading uh, the point where I need to just basically tear down all of this production here and reorganize it. Because it's not very organized right now, put it mildly. These are still shooting. Most of them are not. That because the... Lack of solar cells. Oh no. Oh. You're not wrong. Um. Okay, so there's a lack of these. There's only one product of them. Okay, so what we can do, of course, is just. Ah, okay, we need graphene. 
get one of these. We're going to upgrade that one to produce at least a little bit faster. So how much do these take? Um, hold on. These. Uh, they take one. Takes four seconds to produce one. Got three of these. Which have to be a lot higher production rate than what we have right now. We just happen to have a very large storage of it back in the day. So now it's 20 per second. Not second, uh, 20 per minute. Uh, it's still not enough, but it's better. But yeah, that is why these are not working. I mean, frankly, I might even remove some of these now then. Trying to get towards setting the actual sphere. And these are kind of taking a lot of resources that I could use elsewhere. I mean, how much does this? Not a massive amount of power that it takes, at least. At least not when idle. Oh, looks like we got plenty of graphene here still. Um, plenty might not be the correct word. But it, it does exist, at least. Actually. Is there a way for me to get this set up so that I could set up a second um, production facility over here or assembly machine? Assembler, I believe, is the correct term. Let's keep uh, mixing things up. Right, well, um, I suppose I could do that, but at the same time, it would take a lot of spaghetti again, so I'm kind of tempted not to do that right now. I mean, I suppose what I could do, I could set that as a primary output. Just so that we can keep everything over here going. The way it needs to be. Because this one, while technically important, we can't utilize the stuff over here. We've got plenty for the time being. The so focusing on these might not be that bad of an idea. Although, now that we took one away, it's going to be lowering the amount of uh, form that we have. Now, how much do... Oh, wow, we got plenty in here. Also, I suppose I can just drop those in there. Get the production going. Are these? These are still producing full speed ahead. Right, so I was going to go for the other planet, wasn't I? I get the solar panels? No. Well, in a moment. There we go. So we've got 20. I mean, it's not a lot. I just kind of want to visit the other planet. Strange matter completed. And the other one is going to be 1200. I'm going to take a fair bit of time to research that, but probably not too bad. Okay, where is the planet? Down that way. Zoom. It's right on the other side of the solar system. Well, not completely other side, but almost. Have a look at the... Up here. At least we're moving relatively quickly. Definitely I could... Oh! could actually go even faster. I did not realize that. On the other hand, slowing down from this speed is going to be nightmarish already. I think I'll just let the suit recharge a little bit. I'm going to be using all of the hydrogen. Slow down, slow down, slow down. 
don't want to miss it. I mean, as soon as... As long as we hit the planet, we'll be fine. Right, next question is... Uh, whereabouts is my... Factory? Way over there. A bit far away. Now we can... No. Hmm. Here, oh, there's one of the shuttles. Oh wow, even though we're flying, we're still recharging. Right, uh, I'll just stay here for the time being. Now, where's the equator in here? We're pretty close to it, I reckon. Recharging a little bit, so we're having a slight problem with the power, I, I reckon, but... How much do we have in our suit still? We've got 9.6 gigajoules, that's probably enough. Let the power production continue. Right, uh, I'm just thinking, where... Oh, I believe this is the equator, actually. Setting up a little bit here. Not going to be a massive amount of power produced, especially since this is relatively far away from the center of the system. This is the further planet in the system itself. Right, but that will at least give uh, the steady amount of power for a longer period of time. I suppose I could even take away some of these. Like the solar belts are usually quite common from what I've seen. People that play this. I've been trying to use the solar, solar panels myself, at least on the primary planet there, but I figured that over here it might be worthwhile. Just to make sure that there's always at least a bit of production. Now, um, is the daytime actually arriving? Oh, it is. Now that we place them there, it's actually arriving a bit sooner. Or we're gonna get the power production a bit sooner, at least. Now, how much is the power production here? It's actually not too bad. Use a bit of uh, energy still in our suit. Plus, I can take some of the iron here. Right here, yeah, we got the red ejector there. Which, let's actually hold the inventory once more. I suppose I could actually dismantle some of the facilities here and continue the ring slightly further. It does mean that we're not maximizing the power that we are getting around here during the primary daytime here, but at least it's going to be a slightly steadier amount in the long run. Oh no, that didn't line up correctly. Okay, well, I'm not entirely sure how long or how far are we in terms of... Okay, about 60% maybe. Not 60%, 60 degrees rather. Touching from the, or yeah, I suppose 60 is fairly close, or maybe 40 or 50, somewhere around there. I don't suppose we could uh, craft more in here. Get another five easily. If we go and get some more copper, we can make a lot more. 
need to remember where exactly is the upper production. Oh right, yeah, there wasn't a Oh right, yeah, you guys are out of power. Um do we have wind turbines. I'm gonna build a couple of them here. Get that. I suppose we'll just place one here, even though wind turbines are not the best quality power production in here, but at least it's a little bit of power so they can keep on working throughout the night. Now that's allowing almost a hundred percent. Right. Because this is constantly working, so this is getting 100% all the time, and then this is getting 100% when it needs to. Oh, right, because now it's just daytime. Or morning, at least. Right, I suppose what I could do is just keep on producing these. We should have plenty of silicon in this planet, at least, <laughs> that's for sure. Ah, uh, we got still 4,000. Storage. Uh, all these are rotating slowly. Now, luckily, on this ice planet, there's a lot of range to build on. No need to avoid these or anything like that, or oceans. Another seven, though. Oh, now we need more iron. All right then. So how far are we now? Looks like we are not quite ninety degrees. It's at least a sixty degrees, maybe seventy or eighty. A bit hard to tell exactly, but yeah, it's, uh, it's certainly an improvement. Go get the iron. Keep on building more. Oh, we're gonna make one. Okay, so we really, really need more copper, actually. Right. Well, we should have some extra in there now. Um, honestly, getting uh, uh, the batteries or capacitor or whatever it's called. Accumulator. That's the one. Over here would actually not be a terrible idea. Let me make one. Good. Start making that and then we'll get more total panels. Might be an object. There we go. So we'll fill up that one during the daytime and then it's gonna be allowing to keep these working full speed throughout the night whenever it's needed. I mean, this is. This copper over here is just for my personal use whenever I need it. So it's not that big of a deal. Right. Now we should have a little bit of solar panels again. And it's gonna be night time while we place them, but luckily the day over here on this planet doesn't or isn't all that long, so night doesn't take too much time either. I'm not entirely sure how much of these are producing power total, especially during night time. It's gonna be at zero. Nope, oh, nope. Didn't want you to go there. Okay, so we've gotten all the way there. Now it's at least 90 degrees. Or just shy of it. 
Oh, well, let's go get some more resources. It seems to be already midnight on part of that production, or not production line, um, solar panel array there. Where? I think the other way. Right, um, here we are. Already, oh, it's still evening over here. Doesn't look like we're shooting any new. I suppose there might not be. Or the, um. Yeah, no new solar cell going up there because the direction of the planet might be wrong right now. Or the orange of the planet. Ah, oh, now we need more silicon. Alright then. Easily fixed. Well, I say that's easy to fix, but there might actually not be all that much in here. Well, now we got at least two more. With that, probably going to be enough for doing the solar panels right now on this planet. I reckon we are probably more or less on the other side from the copper. Kind of interesting. So how much do we produce here? Uh, okay, it's 11 megawatts right now and it's going to keep on rising. Solar intensity is only 61% though. This won't be producing all that much power. But well, it is better than nothing. I'm not entirely sure if the soil that you get from here is carried to other planets as well. Might be. I'll quickly grab the iron again. Recharge over here and then... Are we now on the exact other side of the... Solar system. Um, pretty much, pretty much. Well, we'll start flying back nonetheless. Okay, now we're going pretty far. Oh, pretty fast. I think we can go all the way up to 2,000 meters per second right now. I probably won't be doing that anytime soon. Now we wait. So how far are we? Okay, that research is actually going far. Fairly well forward, although it seems like there's a lack of something, which is probably the yellow signs. Oh, right. Flying almost through the sphere, or the swarm here, rather. Not slowing down. 1000 meters per second. Make sure that we are aiming towards the correct planet. Ooh, but now we're shooting more stuff into the swarm. Good. There are quite a few logistical vessels in here. Bring about. A little bit of extra speed there. Okay, so that oil is doing fine. And no, the research is not actually having problems with anything, it's just... Well, it's doing its thing. That's good to know. How much do we have here? We got a total of 460. So it's not too far from 500 total, but we're going to need a lot more. 
And is it, uh... No, it's trying to do the quantum trip again next. All right, then. Well, 500, okay, yeah. It's getting closer. Might be able to get that done. Right, uh, how's the solar cells? Seems like there's plenty of them right now. Of course, uh, the swarm has diminished a decent bit, so we're not getting all that much power from there, but we do still have relatively good power production, even without the swarm. I mean, the swarm is still providing some, just not quite as much. Got plenty of processors here, and we're just waiting for the stuff over here. How much do we have? Okay, four, uh, not fourteen hundred, twelve hundred and twenty-eight. There. Are these working? At least that one's working. One's not actually working. Now it is. Not getting the resources either. This one is working as fast as it can, but we do have the power supply problem, so let's go ahead and get another thermal power station, I suppose. Get started, at least. And I suppose I just place it down here. The end of the line. That one there. On there. Oh, there's multiple ones that don't even have anything. Okay. We upgrade that. That might be the weakest link right now. Because it's a long one. Okay, yeah, these are getting the power, and that one is not getting the stuff yet. Is there a reason for that? And now it is. Conversion rate 80%. Okay, well. It's working. That's plenty. How much do we have hydrogen here still? Ah, oh, uh, okay. We're starting to go through a lot of it. May need to expand the productions here again. Luckily, we do have the room. Just don't have the refinery yet, but that can be easily fixed. I'm going to just link it there, and yeah, there's a lot of graphite going through. Well, some graphite going through. A fair bit in there, although it seems like it's slowly going down right now. Plastic is still packed up quite well. Do we have here? We got 600. Not too bad. Do we have. Okay, we've got plenty of silicon now. The titanium storage is almost full. And we've got some graphite, graphene over here. They yeah, are not too bad in terms of resources there. The only problem over here is just the processors. And the processes are having problems because these are not working fast enough. They are working full speed at least. And it seems like copper is no longer an issue. At least not currently an issue. There's a lot being produced here. That one... No. Quickly sort the items again just to see how much room I actually have in the inventory. Which seems to be a fair bit. Now, I suppose I can take some of the silicon in here. Not entirely sure what I'm going to do with them. And uh, okay, so orbital collector. Um, yeah, accumulator. Oh! So I can't make those. How the hell I do? Got a minute. Let's produce one of these. 
check if we let it recharge assuming that it's actually going to be recharged right now because of our power pro production potential issues now it's not filling up okay bit unfortunate oh we're gonna get the research done at least after that we might actually call it here or there uh because well this is gonna take a while i'll probably do that off camera maybe get the gravity matrix does that require the information no okay good now we're gonna have to get this one at some point just to get some of the productions higher and eventually we do need to redo all of this production now that I can kind of figure out what I need and where. I'm shooting some more solar cells. Good. I've got a few more. Those, but not much on you. Have we gotten okay? So we have started getting a bit of a stockpile of solar cells again, although that might be used during daytime rather quickly. How much power do we have? Okay, so we're still having a slight problem with the power satisfaction. Another thermal production or power production although the more that we use these or the more that we use hydrogen as a power of the what is this gonna be for us actually think about this does it take to make one of these so it's about what five seconds to make five so one per second okay so using deuterium as a fuel would probably not be enough to cover the cost of this all the power cost of this. All right then, good to know. Technically, even the. On the other hand, well, yeah, it's one per second. Nine mega. Oh, nine. Yeah, nine mega joules. Well, actually, no, it would be twelve mega joules required. Use all that, okay. Also, be using our hydrogen rather swiftly here. Might get rid of that tank at some point, or I might not. Although, as soon as we get the sphere underway and we can start getting some production or power production from that, then we can start reducing some of these power plants. we got yeah we got about 600 those uh we needed one 800 yeah had five percent of that done so that would be not all that much to be fair 750 required but yeah we can at least go through that with an okay speed now because as soon as we run through the um, reserves, it shouldn't be that much required. 